Hi there and welcome to today's Quentin Carpenter Nature of Flowers Photoshop tutorial. Today we're going to be using Photoshop 2023 and we're going to be doing one of these sliced heads. Okay, to do that you can see we've got a head and we've sliced it into three little sections. We're going to get a photograph of a head. We take a photograph of a person. Once we've got that we're going to select just the head to get rid of the background out of the picture. To do this, the easiest way to do it with the new Photoshop is to click Select Subject. It will work out what the subject is. If it doesn't quite get it, because some of the colours here or the greys are very similar, we're going to go to the Quick Selection tool, make sure on the minus, and we're going to get rid of some of the bits that we don't want around the back of the head here. Uh, and if we get too much, we're going to go to the plus, and we're going to add bits back in like so. So we get exactly the selection that we want. We'll press the minus. Once we've done this, we're going to copy and paste this onto a new layer. So we're going to go to Edit, Copy, and Edit, Paste. And you can now see we closed the layer. It was on originally a cutout layer. What we need to do for this effect is to cut this into three sections. We'll use the lasso tool. We'll cut the top bit off like so. And we will go to Edit, Cut, Edit, Paste, and you can see we've got a new layer with the top of the head on, and then we we'll move that where we want it. We're going back to the layer with the remainder of the head. We'll do another selection of the main part of it, like so, and we'll do the same thing to this edit, cut, edit, paste, and we'll move that as well. Now, all we need to do is slightly tilt these. Moving the cursor just outside the box to create that tilt, click on the top layer, slightly tilt that, move it slightly back, and move it like this. Now all we need to do is add some three-dimensionalness to the image, so we will get the lasso tool, create a new layer, underneath layer 5, which is the middle bit of the head, draw a little section, can look like the 3D bit, like so. Get our fill gradient tool, make sure we're black and white, draw a little line and create that effect. And we can then go onto the bottom layer, do the same sort of thing. Make sure we've got the selection tool on the lasso, draw a little section back, like so. Go on our fill tool, and do our little bit of filling. So it's nice and dark. You'll notice the order of some of these. We need to make sure that we've got a background as well. So we go into the background layer and add a full gradient. Okay. Make sure we're on the gradient tool. In the background layer. And then add a big gradient to the background. Like that. Oh, actually. I think like that. And then you can see we have our cutout face with different sections. Okay, have fun experimenting doing this with different styles of cutouts, etc. And if you've enjoyed this tutorial, feel free to pop over to the channel, hit that subscribe button, etc. etc. Okay. Thanks for watching and goodbye.